If you are in the market for emerald gemstones, you may be wondering about the differences between lab-created emeralds and those found naturally in the earth. Both have their pros and cons in terms of quality, supply, and uh, environmental impact. In this video, we'll take a deep dive into understanding lab-grown emeralds versus natural emeralds, so you can make an informed choice. Hi everyone, I'm Sasha Kariva, and on this channel I will talk about gemstones. Welcome! What are emeralds? Before we get into the specifics of uh, lab-grown and natural, let's go over some basics about emeralds themselves. Emeralds are a variety of the mineral beryl colored green by trace amounts of chromium and uh, sometimes vanadium. They rate uh, 7.5 to 8 on the most hardness scale, making them quite durable for gemstone jewelry. Emeralds have been prized as gemstones for millennia, treasured by ancient cultures like the Egyptians, uh, Incas, and Moguls. Today, emeralds are found in Colombia, Zambia, Brazil, Pakistan, and other locations. The striking green color along with rarity compared to other gems makes them an attractive choice for fine jewelry. The four CS for grading emeralds are color, clarity, cut, and carat weight. Unlike diamonds, which prioritize colorlessness, emeralds are judged by the depth and the saturation of the green hue. Iron can cause undesirable bluish undertones. Eye clean clarity free of visible inclusions is also favored, so complete clarity is extremely rare in natural emeralds. Emeralds. I have already a detailed video devoted to natural emeralds and their origins. Don't forget to watch it. What are lab-grown emeralds? Lab-created or synthetic emeralds have the same chemical, physical, and optical properties as natural emerald. There are two main methods used to grow emeralds in a laboratory setting. First is flux grown. This process involves combining beryllium oxide with chromium and other components which are melted together into a flux or solvent. As the solution slowly cools over months, emerald crystals form. Emerald grown this way may contain small metallic remnants affecting clarity. Hydrothermal process. Uh, this method more closely mimics the way emeralds form in the earth. Emerald seeds are placed in a chemical solution and baked under high heat and pressure over months. The seeds are gradually built up on atom by atom, producing higher clarity emeralds. Creating ideal conditions allows labs to precisely control the growing process, and gemstones chemical make up inclusions, color, and clarity in ways nature cannot. How do lab uh, emeralds stack up qualitatively compared to those from mines? Let's look at the fossils. Color both can produce a wide spectrum of attractive green hues from bluish green to yellowish green. Labs have more ability to hit a specific desired tone through chemical composition control. Clarity. Top lab emeralds with minimal inclusions can actually exceed the clarity of most natural emeralds, which tend to have more flaws. However, it is possible to find clean natural emeralds uh, with uh, relatively high clarity as well. Cut. This comes down to the cutter skill for both lab and natural stones. Ideal cutting can maximize a gemstone's brilliance and fire. Labs may allow slight advantages by providing rough crystals free of fractures or inclusions that could impact the cut. Carat weight. Uh, while nature provides a limited supply, laboratories can theoretically grow emeralds in any size or weight exceeding what's commonly found in mines. So, in summary, lab emeralds can sometimes exceed the quality of average commercial grade natural stones in terms of color purity, clarity, cut quality potential and available size. But world-class natural emeralds from renowned sites can equal or even exceed the visual splendor of many lab emeralds when evaluating the very finest gems. Identifying the lab versus natural with quality potentially comparable, being able to identify natural versus uh, lab emeralds is important for informed purchase decisions and valuation. Here are some key ways to determine origin these inclusions. Natural will show more crystals, irregularities, mineral deposits, fissures, and uh, three-phase inclusions, solid, liquid, gas. Labs 
aim for optimal clarity and exhibit less complex inclusion since if any. Next, growth patterns. Natural emeralds display octagonal growth breaks and uh, color zoning reflecting erratic formation. Labs reveal more uniform growth with smooth uh, geometric pattern. Advanced techniques spectroscopy can identify unique chemicals fingerprints exposing synthetic origins. Emeralds from uh, reputable sources should provide certification validating they identify quality specs and origins as natural or lab created. While quality is important, there are also key differences in supply and pricing between these two emerald categories. Emerald output is finite and increasingly dwindling from major mines in Colombia, Zambia and other regions dealing with political instability, controversial mining practices and depleting reserves. This decreasing supply puts cost pressures on wholesale and retail pricing for natural emeralds. Lab production. Commercial labs like uh, Chatman, Terus, uh, Gilson, uh, other can steadily produce consistent amounts of high-grade emeralds in line with demand. This alleviates uh, supply shortage, keeping prices for lab emeralds more stable and affordable compared to rare and natural counterparts. On average, uh, lab emeralds cost 20-35% less than similar quality natural emeralds, so prices can vary widely at retail based on carat size, cutting and individual quality. The biggest price disparities are for larger size over 2 carats when natural emeralds grow exponentially more expensive based on limited supply. For buyers on a budget or desiring larger emerald size, the lab grown option provides higher clarity quality and consists supply at substantial savings versus dwindling sources of natural emerald. Those seeking ultimate rarity may prefer natural specimens despite higher pricing. Ethical and environmental impacts another consideration for emerald buyers today is the ethics and environmental impacts surrounding the gemstone sources. Unfortunately, many of the world's natural emerald deposits exist in nations with troubling human rights issues and exploitative mining practice linked to violence, uh, poverty, environmental destruction and uh, corruption. Even ethically sourced operations can have concerning track records. By contrast, many modern gemstone laboratories prioritize sustainable business models with closer oversight of working conditions and environmental practices. Labs avoid many hazards of underground mining completely while still using substantial energy and resources during production. Synthetic emeralds offer a way to purchase beautiful gemstone, avoiding direct ties to regional conflicts and environmental abuses surrounding some natural sources. One final factor to understand that both natural and synthetic emeralds may be treated or enhanced before sale. These treatments aim to improve uh, visible appearance by filling fractures, removing inclusions or boosting color saturation. Some common emerald uh, treatments include oiling or resin filling, heating with chemicals, flux additives, fracture filling, high pressure temperature treatments, surface diffused, coloring irradiation, dyeing. While treatments don't necessarily devalue the emerald, full disclosure on any processes used should be provided by the seller. Whether the stone is natural or lab grown, Treatments could impact long-term stability and accurate gem identification. Quality grading reports detail enhancement disclosures. Both natural and uh, lab-created emeralds can offer striking beauty well suited for fine jewelry. While natural emeralds from prestigious sources represent ultimate rarity and preciousness, they continue facing limited suppliers and ethical mining concerns driving up costs. High-quality lab emeralds are consensual, eco-friendly and budget-friendly alternative providing consistent quality and availability free of regional conflicts. Whether you ultimately favor the prestige and investment value on ethically mined natural emeralds or prefer the unmatched brilliance of advanced synthetic emerald at more reasonable prices, having the facts allows you to make the most educated buying decision aligned with your taste and values. Always insist uh, on uh, full transparency, including quality grading reports to verify precisely what you are purchasing. Do you research and choose wisely between lab and natural to ensure the most enjoyment from this magnificent green gemstone for a lifetime? In our uh, True Gems company, we believe in transparency and provide detailed information 
information about each gemstone, including its origin, gradient reports, and higher resolution images. This allows you to make informed decisions with confidence. By the way, I'm offering free consultation, which you can easily book using the link provided in the description below. Feel free to schedule an appointment at your convenience. Our consultation allows me to answer any question you may have in full detail. This is a rare chance to speak directly with a certified gemologist. I highly recommend booking a slot uh, so I can personally understand your preferences and identify the gemstones that best fits your desires. I look forward to this one-on-one -on -one discussion to ensure you find your ideal gem or just send a message on WhatsApp. Don't wait any longer. Visit True Gems today and let us help you make your gemstone dream a reality.